Oh my freaking gosh, we got blinds. They look so good. The guy was here for less than an hour installing them. Let me show you. So we went with budget blinds and I am so happy. I'll have to look and see if I have the info on the order sheet of what we went through. It's a very, it looks more gray. It's a very grayish color and they just pull right up. We could not do one long one because of how long these windows are. He even said like they wish their manufacturers would all get on the same page. But he said like depending on what you use, most of them don't go as big as this window. Um, but he said like he just knew off the top of his head that this one did not. So look at that. Look how much darker it is in here. Oh my gosh. It's the middle of the day. You guys, we have been sleeping horribly because of how bright the freaking moon has been. And then I'll go show you what we did. Look at this. We still have all this junk out here from Roman's birthday. We've got to get that put up. But no, I love, I love them so much. Oh my gosh, they look so pretty. Okay. We still have this set, by the way. It's very great quality if you're looking for one. So now before I get too ahead of myself because I'm so excited, we waited. I knew I could trust my judgment, but there was still that like 2% of me that was like, wait until you see, because we were very high priority, wanted to get the boys and the game room blinds in. Like I wanted to get those in first. Um, and I was just like, I don't know if I'm like confident enough in my decision to order the entire house's blinds they're all gonna look like the ones in our bedroom. And I was like, what if I don't like them? Like, at least if they're in our bedroom, no one will see them and I can pick a different fabric. I love them. I'm gonna call her today and have her reorder them. Yes, we do have to pay two install fees and we had to pay like taxes twice in the whole nine, but I would rather do that and know I'm 100% happy. Oh my God, I love them so much. So we got ones that are a little bit more light blocking in here and they have a little piece at the bottom and then they, roll up. I'm not sure if you can see the roll right there, but oh, I love them. You can see here and I got theirs in a gray, like a true gray, because that's what they didn't have as many color options with the blackout for these. Um, but I wanted for them to be a neutral color so that, you know, I mean, he's not going to be in this forever. He's not going to have this wall art and I wanted them to blend and, you know, still look modern enough that they last for years and years. So very happy with how low profile these look too. Like you barely, I feel like you would walk in and honestly not even notice that. Oh, I'm so freaking happy with those blinds. They look amazing. All right guys, what a couple, what a few hours it's been, I guess. Um, so we, I showed you guys, I gotta get these balloons gone. I showed you guys the blinds yesterday. We are completely obsessed with them, but that means it's time to redo this room. So we've been going, of course, room by room throughout the house. Like we have the laundry room done, which have I showed you guys? I don't know if I have shown to you in a minute. Um, when we moved into this house, we brought some furniture with us. We had ordered some that wasn't put together yet. And one of the biggest things is we went from a house with average ceiling height to this. So I had never lived in a home with super high ceilings. And of course I know when you have a home with high ceilings, you need things to be higher. What I did not anticipate is this bed frame that I have here does not slash cannot have a box spring. And I just didn't in my head, like it didn't, because it is one of these, like there's this little, the bed's not made, it's bothering crap on me. There's a handle right down here and you can lift up the entire thing. You've got storage underneath, which is super, super nice. With that being said, you can't put a box spring on it. And I didn't know that, like we had a box spring ready to go. That means that the bed is so low. So we have this higher, it's just not our favorite. It's a great bed frame. It's beautiful. It's a great size. Quality is amazing. I love that we have storage underneath it, but it's just not what we need for the height of the ceiling in this room. So we decided we're going to go with a canopy bed. We're going to get chairs because we also made this so much like we added 18 inches to this room in order to make the closet and the bathroom bigger. 
18 inches doesn't sound like a lot, but the problem is it's 18 inches all the way. So it's like, there's so much room in here that it's just, I wasn't prepared for it. And when we moved in, I was seven million weeks pregnant and just over it. So we just kind of sat on it for a while. And I'm, again, I've, I've said this before and I'll say it again. I'll say it till I die. Sometimes you have to live in a space to know what you want from it, to know what things will work best. Um, originally we wanted a bench. So I got a bench that I'm sitting on. Don't like the bench anymore because it's too small. We need more to fill this room. Bubba, you're in underwear. I can't have you on camera. Um, so my Esther's just almost completely naked. So anyways, I'm in here now to measure. I found a bed. I'll show it to you guys in a second. Nope. Oh my God, you're covered in dirt. Hold on. So anyway, I'll show you guys the furniture in a second, but no Roman, <laughs> but we're going to measure real quick and hopefully Roman can't reach this camera, but. That's very high. I like it. 95. Yup. Yup. Already like that more. And then we're going to get two chairs. This will be roughly. Oh, yeah, that's going to be so much better. 37. Yeah, by 35. Yep. 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 That's going to be nice. That's what we're going to do. Me. Check on E who's playing in the dirt. He, I gotta, I gotta get that gone. Um, there's plants whenever we got back from vacation. I had heard like your kids will start to see their toys and think, oh, these are new toys because it's like they forget about them. Well, problem is they felt that way about my plants. They destroyed my plants, like absolutely destroyed them. So I just let them die. I was like, I, I can't do this. Okay. So let me show you. So we've got this chair. I ordered like a million swatches because it never looks the same um, in person as it does online. But this is the same as the two sofas we have and we love them. This is a performance fabric. We're thinking we want the same thing because you can wipe these clean in seconds and it's just so easy and they look really nice and they're not too rounded. I just, we've been very happy with those. Um, even the light fabric, like you can clean that in seconds with just a little bit of Folex. So performance fabric is key here and that's what we're gonna go with, but I need to get the swatches and we're gonna get two of those. And then this is the bed that we're looking at. It's again, 95 high. The only thing is the back. I wanna know what that color kind of looks like, but that's what I'm excited about. So that's what we've got so far. And then I'll show you guys the laundry room because I don't know if I've showed you this yet. It's a little chaotic in here, but this is another room we have to <laughs> We have to get decorated. It's just a little chaotic, but we got two floating shelves and we actually had our finisher come in and do these custom to the same color as the floors and the countertops in here. This is butcher block. Um, and so we bought the butcher block and he just finished it. I think he did this piece separate though. I think he custom made that piece, but the finisher on the home, we just loved him so much. So we had him come back and do this and then those as well. Sorry, the lighting in here is crazy but it won't be for long because we're gonna get blinds in here. So yeah, love these floating shelves, but we need to get them decorated. Right now this has, Sam Robinson was here written all over it. And I gotta put my laundry away today. So whew, it's a lot, but it feels good to be here doing this, getting things complete. These are just tasks that I've wanted to have done for so long, but one, I think you need to live in a space a little while before you make these decisions. Two, in order to do it right, like it's very expensive and it's not something you can just up and like, well, some people can, but I, it's crazy just to furnish an entire home at once. Um, and that was one thing, even as a designer, like people used to order an entire furniture's worth for their home. And I was like, live in your home for a little while first. I gotta go, Roman is making a mess and Ezra's playing in dirt, so. It's been nice to escape and talk to you guys. <laughs> Thanks for watching. We'll see you tomorrow.